Hello guys, today I want to quickly show you a new package called Laravel Data Dumper by The Dragon Code. It works on top of Laravel feature called Squashing Migrations or Schema Dump and I will show you that in a minute. And it dumps the data alongside the schema during Schema Dump. Let me show you that in action. But before I do that, I also need to mention other ways to do the same thing. So there's, of course, a well-known Spotty Laravel backup. So if your use case is a nightly or daily backup or something like that, of course, use this package. And I have a video about that and I will link that in the description below. Also, there's a package called iSeed, Orange Hill iSeed, really old one. And at the time of shooting this video, it's not yet updated to Laravel 11. So it works with Laravel 10 and below, which allows you to generate seeds. So your data from the database into seeds. But if your use case is as described in the docs of squashing migrations, you want to kind of archive hundreds of migration files into SQL file, then that new package Laravel Data Dumper may help you to archive important data with that. So I have installed that package with Composer Require and then let me show you how it works without the package Schema Dump and with that package. So if we launch PHP Artisan Schema Dump, there's a new file database schema. In our case, it's SQLite schema. So it's just an SQL file for recreating the tables without migrations. But now if I enable that package, which I do in config database, we just list the tables that we want to dump the data from. And now if we relaunch schema dump and we open that SQL file, that SQL file will contain insert statements for all the tables. At that point, all the data from the database will be dumped into this SQL file. And that's all that package does. It works with these databases provided and the only configuration is the list of tables. That's it. The only thing I personally disliked here is the name of the configuration value, which is schema. And the package is not about the schema. I would have called it probably something like data dumper, which is exactly what the package does. But anyway, it works, it does the job, works with Laravel 11 and quick to install. What do you think? Would you use that in your projects? Or you use other tools for doing the same thing? Let's discuss in the comments below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.